Hi everyone. Today I'm going to be running through um, Topaz Denoise AI um, and giving it a, a quick look at to see how it can work on some of your noisy night photos. Um, so stay with me and we'll look at that right after the break. So thanks for staying with me, guys. Um, as I said, we're going to have a look at Topaz Denoise, um, and we're going to see what it can do for one of my night photos. Um, so at the moment, I have this photo open in a program called Affinity Photo, which is a bit like a Photoshop replacement without the subscription. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to zoom into this just a little bit, and you can see that there's a lot of noise, um, which you would expect on one of these sorts of photos. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually open this photo in um, Topaz Denoise. Um, so what this is now gonna do is it's now gonna open up the photo in Topaz Denoise, um, where I can then start to see what the differences are we're gonna be. Um, all right. So the one on the right hand side is the one that's actually got the improvement. The one on the left is the one that um, obviously doesn't. So you can actually see there, it makes a remarkable difference. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to close out of this. Um, and in Affinity Photo, I'm going to duplicate this layer. Um, and so the reason I'm going to do that is so that I can show you the difference. All right. So all this lets me do is it just lets me turn on and off the denoise. Um, so as I said, I'll go back into denoise. It's going to open up denoise. So this is version 2.2.2. Um, I'm going to go down to the bottom and have a look at some of the differences. I'm going to change this to 50% because I think I might show them a little bit. Um, and I'm going to, at the moment, I've got it set on Denoise AI. I'm going to let it auto-detect the settings and we're going to see what it does. So we've auto-detect settings. You can see it's actually made a pretty big difference. So I'm going to come in to 200% or so. Uh, which maybe is a little bit too far, to be honest. Um, and you can see what it's trying to do is it's trying to keep some level of detail. You know, at 200%, that's probably a little bit close. So you see it better at 100%. So you can see there, that's a remarkable difference. Left-hand side is the noisy version. The right-hand side is the um, edited version. Um, so one thing that I would suggest um, if you are using night photos specifically is do this at the very end of your photo. Um, so if you're using a stack-in technique, um, you're going to want to um, do your stacks first and then remove the noise because what you might find happens otherwise is um, you might remove some of the stuff that you actually need. Um, so I'm happy with all of this. Um, I'm going to turn on low light mode. And so low light mode is designed basically for um, cell phones and those sorts of things um, to try and get a little bit more out of the photo when you're um, not working with a lot of information. Um, so I'm going to click on the apply button, which is behind my chair. Um, so click on apply. This is now gonna process this photo um, and then it will return it into Affinity Photo itself. Um, so once we're in Affinity Photo, we can then have a look at the difference between the two photos, see what they look like. All right, so we're back in Affinity Photo and I have two photos here. So I've got this one here, which is the unedited version. And then if I turn that on, this is the edited version. 
So you can see the amount of noise, um, especially around the water, that it's actually pulled out is quite remarkable um, compared to what it was before. Now, I don't see quite the same amount of detail in the sky that it's removed. Um, no, there's a little bit, but um, it's far more noticeable around the water. So you can see something like Denoise AI does have some really incredible benefits, um, especially when you're working with really low light um, photos. Um, things like long exposure, astrophotography and so on, where there is a lot of noise that you do need to try and deal with um, in the photo itself. Um, so I hope this has been useful. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, um, subscribe to my channel um, and stay tuned for more. Thanks for watching. Always do it on my own, so I gotta get through it And the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing Never give up, never slow, till I finally prove it Never listen to the nose, I just wanna keep moving Yeah, I put out all the heart, it's my only medicine Yeah, everything I do, I'm just being genuine Yeah, I'm sick of being screwed, feel my own adrenaline Yeah, I do just what I do, and I hope you let me in, let me in, yeah